Hi there and welcome back my friend to Nenezia and we've got new plans now with our King Scrungles of Nenezia, the great and brilliant strategist. We still have some counties that we could get, we're not that bad at stewardship to consider so that we can see that there is something we can do and time to aim for something. Last time we've plagued a little bit the frog of Novgorod and now maybe it's time to go for a Bajik, the tormentor of Kazaria because he's also not like the greatest. <laughs> I'm a little bit ignoring these in favor of yeah, I mean, it's a strategic choice. We're a brilliant strategist, so what would be easier to defend here? Now, if we're going for Willet, that would be a great choice to catch that thing, but it's actually very exposed out there, and it has two fronts. And then, like these two also have two fronts this is also not like this has even one two three fronts so the question isn't like yeah so what to safely take is i mean it's a little bit underdeveloped from the advances but ugra seems like the way to go it seems like the the thing to go for so let's get into position and then when we are in position, we will declare a war on King Kagan Bajik, the Tormentor. And, let's see. We we'll go for the conquest of Ugra, where no one would join in except the Yen Chepi clan. Let's have a look at the Yen Chepi clan. That is here, and it's not that impressive. So that's about Ugra. Let's look into more depth here. If we go for a holy war, that will lead to additional problems for us. We could go for a war on Petrora. Look at that, that includes like everything. That's a little bit much maybe. We have a de jure claim on Ugra, which would make Chief Sematu, our new liege, but we don't want him as a liege. He has like the wrong faith, so to say, and that's why we'll go for the conquest of Ugra. But now let's first get in position. The two troops we can look at who is there and actually there's not much there and so let's declare the, that war for Ugra <coughs> the conquest of Ugra everyone says yes and I believe we should charge in let's see 400 we have Carl here good at this we need another flanker, maybe. Mm. Rodulf would be a good choice. Mm. And now we've got other people we can let this army lead by Bercy. Bercy should take this because of course there's 100 cavalry is good at that and then we've got the herdman harold who's also a cavalry leader mm. yeah let's actually use him here then Bercy in here and
we've got Falky for the wrist. He's still learning. Here we go. And there's a couple more people coming. Yeah, he's called his vassals in. They're not that great, but they make up like 5,000 or something. So that's going to be really interesting. We've won that one. We're sieging here. Mm. We'll send the other troop over here. To prevent further. And look, the army of Shaman Hazaba of Petchora also started to attack. Oh, Ugra tribe has made some trouble for us, but no worries, I think. This will be going well with Bercy as the leader. He's even better than Biho, the commander of Yen Chepi, who is, a, who is an erudite strategist. Not bad, but ultimately not enough, probably. Whoa, what a battle. Look, this. they are not going down so so easily. They will lose a lot of people. And we lost as well. That's not good. Oh, look. These guys will arrive in Washka soon. Meaning... We'll go for something else there. Mm. When will they be there? On the 7th of August? When will we be there? 16th of July, the army of B. Hall will be there on 16th of July, 10th of August, 7th of August. Hmm. When can we be here? There. 1st of August. And if we have... Falky in... If we take ourselves, actually, because we're a great organizer, 19th of July. Yeah, let's actually meet up there. Scrungles is, of course, the superior one. We can usurp the Jaldum of Mezen. A couple of gold. Aha. Give us 50 prestige and cost a couple of gold. We'll do that once we have Ugra as well. Will they come now? They are now moving to Wim. Not get away from this so quickly. But that means we should bring Scrungles back to this. We'll be there on the 25th of July. They will win this in the next tick. Victory. After the army enters Ugra tribe, any sense of discipline is lost and the men start to rob, burn and pillage. <sighs> that again. That again. Now we're a berserker now. Ah. Uh.
but I will we will try to to stop this because we're still nagging on the weak leader thing. Stop this immediately and hang the culprits. And we stopped it. This time we're a strong leader. Let's move. 15th of July, 25th of July. Will they go back now? No, they won't hold back. There it goes. Let's see if they lock in. They've locked in. Let's unite the armies. We have Karl here. Flanker Lightfoot leader. But Falky here. Mm. I don't know. I think we can use Hrodulf here for the other flank. Hmm. And Karl. Yeah, not Karl. Rodolf. Yeah, Bercy is coming with the Entsatz army here. Maybe we can join in there still. It's coming here. Let's send these to Washka as well. Led by Falky, you will, but better than nothing. That's a big confrontation here. Siege of Ugra tribe, though, our war goal is there. And that's the most important thing for now. Whoa, now look. Let's have a look. The attackers. Mm -hmm. We've got much better leaders. That doesn't even mean too much, but we'll see. We'll see. Bercy is also joining in. Look, yeah, yeah, that, that's something we'll have to look at. Has killed of Norweg. Yeah, let's send these 35 people in. You never know. How many do we have here? 148. That's going to be interesting. Sturbjorn, come over. Mezen. Yum, yeah. Here we go. They're coming. Wow, in full strength. And when will we be there? It will be a while. Let's hope we can win this before they arrive. Yes, our Kibar was captured in battle is now my prisoner. Tengri Pagan. You'll make a suitable sacrifice to Odin. Very good, very good. Mm. Folky, our vassal, has declared on, on whom? And now we're missing Falky or what? No, we need a new advisor. What has happened to our advisor? Don't know. We have Sender, our vessel. Uh, Falky, the Jarl of Sjelland. Considered a powerful vessel. Faction leader Gare. Uh, he's he's a little bit easier to handle for us. The High Chieftess has 
great hate for us. Mm. We need to integrate Folky. Let's hope that's making him... Yeah, he likes us now. He's a pragmatist too. Now more people are coming here. Oh, my concubine Damutara is pregnant. That's interesting. Okay. She taught our father before he went mad, though. Not sure if this is a good sign or what. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, that was maybe not the best choice to go in there. Wow, look at that. Uh, the losses of this man. Now we gotta get lost ourselves. Oh, uh, wait, 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 wait. We'll go to Silma with that army of Bursi. Just getting a few more things under our belt before winter begins. What's happened here? Okay, one cannot occupy this for some reason. Here we go. Won that siege. Go over here. How many people do we have here? Wow, that's not much. And what's going on here? Uh, not a big army. Let's see what we can do here. 51% is not bad. There we are. Percy is doing what he can, slaughtering. <laughs> Savarot. She's calmed down a bit. Noble by the name of Bai Renben came to court today seeking asylum. He claims to have escaped from China after the rest of his family was executed on orders of the Emperor. O oh, great king, your merciful nature is known across the land. I implore you to grant me refuge. It would be an untold kindness. Yeah, the enemies of our enemies are our friends. You are welcome to stay. The Emperor is far away, and maybe he has something interesting to say. The vision turns red with bloodlust, and you charge ahead without regard for your safety as your nearest companions hurry to keep up. Surrender to your berserker rage, and your axe cuts a wide swath in the enemy ranks. When the dust settles, they find you standing over half a dozen slain foes. God for all! The Battle of Ishma tribe, we've won that. That's good. Someone's attacking us here. I wonder who? Or was it that troop here? What's happening to them now? Oh, I see. Behaw. We did it. Captured in battle. The cat, the chat was cap captured in battle. 
What a terrible commander. It was really him. What a terrible commander. Ah, uh, well... I don't know, but he will make a suitable sacrifice to Odin, I'm sure. Well, let's see. Can we ransom this man? No. Here we go. We went for this, but it's only temporary. Who is coming? Wow, there's more people coming. I think we need to send Falky in. Let's see how this works. The Protector General of the Exalted Emperor addresses a letter to the Great King of the Kingdom of Nenezia. Heaven's blessing upon thee. It has come to the attention of Emperor Hei Dizong that you are harboring an enemy of the Xia Empire. If Rai Renban is not returned at once, Emperor Hei Dizong will be most displeased. Ah. How far away are they? Powerful is this man. Ah. Uh, okay, they have heard of it. Um. I mean. We're a brilliant strategist. We can see that this will only lead to harm. Uh, I suppose we better return him. I'm sorry. The political decision amidst that war, we cannot have another big war. Can imprison Seymund of Essex, what is he planning? Probably wants to kill someone, right? Hmm, I don't know. Goodness, there's more and more people coming here. Trying to get us out of this. Question is, what should we do? Should we like proceed and, and run in here trying to murder these people? Or shall we stay here? I believe we could maybe stay. Let's also unite our troops here. Or could we... Here. But Carl on that side. I think we want Carl here. As a Lightfoot leader. And then on the other side we have. Um, Rodolf is not so good anymore. Oh, he's injured. That's not good. Mm. Yeah, then we'll have to use Bercy. Need someone leading this troop. Falky. Good as a winter soldier up there. Perhaps it could help me to increase Queen Alba's opinion of me if I just sent her a gift. The show of friendship and good faith. A magnificent gift. Wow. A fancy gift. Let's go for the middle thing. Fancy gift should do the trick. And it did. Let's see what will happen to us. Yeah, these 68 men. Let's send them in as well. Queen Alva received my gift really well. She informed me that it was a very kind gesture, one that she will soon not forget. Okay, very nice. Our wife loves us. That's what we all wanted. Hmm. 
Mm, they are moving to Strukar. Oh, <laughs> another car gun was called in. Mm, I'm not sure how I feel about this. We have our best men here, and they're doing what they can. Soon after writing to the Chinese Emperor, a very grateful emissary arrived with several guards to escort Ray ben, Renbin back to the Chinese Empire. You can't understand what they'll do to me, screamed Renbin. He was dragged out. I'm sure he can't be that bad. Yeah, I'm sure he dies. That's it, but... Uh, Siege of Isma tribe was one. That's good. Mm, we've dragged Chavara out of this. Oh, and this guy. Wasn't he? Yeah, he's the heir. Good, good, good. Um, said you... Well, I don't know. Koshma. Now let's strike them first here, I guess. Well, that's just light infantry here. Should be okay with this, but. Yeah, we should be okay with this. Let's go to Bell. They're streaming in here. Except paying your ransom. And this girl... Also very valuable. I could have sworn I heard the enemy commander High Chief amo I moored two barking orders. As I search the forest, he's nowhere to be found. A fellow soldier finally informs me that he's been spotted cowering in the far back behind a hollow tree and most disgracefully behind his troops. Ah, yeah, we're brave. There you are. I've been itching for a fight. It's a good day for a duel, I chuckle. Putting my masterful short sword in my hand. Enough talking, my opponent growls. Soon High Chief Imord is lying face down in the snow, as I have seen to slice half of his face completely off. Um. Hmm. I walk away victorious, I think. Let's show that we're the better man. More and more and more. Oh, look. A son was born to King Scrungles of Nenetia and Damutara the Gentle named Stein. The stone. And what will he be? Okay. He'll be on duty. There's more and more people coming in now. How can we... How can we resist... Run. Got more people here. And we can... Now yeah, we've got the advantage still. But it's a hard time. So many battles. <laughs> it's crazy. Have we finally won that thing? Manas was captured in battle and is now my prisoner. He will make... Will he? Yeah, he'll make a suitable sacrifice for Odin. And Papa Chatten. It's that. She 
she would be paid for. She's a direct leader and heavy infantry leader. Or he. Sacrifice him as well. Ah, one of your vassals can be discouraged from associating with conspirational factions. Now, he's our friend, will do nothing. Nothing at all. Battle of Veltribe was won. Gazek was captured in battle, is now my prisoner. And he's kind of up there to sacrifice. Many people are in this. Wow, that's too much. Let's run over here. So my great diplomatic skill, the smuggler's ring in Nega has been destroyed. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we're sacrificing people left and right. Let's see if we can sell some still. Cheraba, the chiefess of Isma. Well, here we go. And we can look for a new commander. The good order. Yeah, we made him the mayor. Been waiting to do this. Have him as a tough soldier aside. And what else we have? Folky the Jarl of Sjelland, Samon the Chief of Essex could be our herdman as well. Now let's go for Folky first, we can trust him. Drotseti, a steward of the realm. Hmm. Maybe the chief of Biamia. Nice. So we've got a lot. are collecting themselves again. We'll lead that battle. Won that too. Let's move over. A troop. Let's see what we can do here. Hopefully we'll be there quickly. My brother Goodmund has asked me to spend some quality time, family time in Okladinokwa. I'm sure the idea is for me to become better friends with Prince Sturbjorn of Nenezia, our half-brother. Mm, yeah, why not? That, that sounds nice. We, we like our family because the family likes us as well. Here we go, and another battle. Still, we can win now. And when the Kargan is giving in, we'll say yes to that. We won. We've got Ugra. And that means... Mother, it's a job for you. And Prince Eamon actually doesn't love us anymore. Oh, that's bad. Can now go for the Jaldom of Mezen. 
that wouldn't be bad, right? But we can still keep the counties, and so I think we'll do that. Look at the Ugra tribe. They've got a wooden hill fort. They need a stone hill fort as well, so... Mm. I think that's that's going to be good to improve that instantly. Here we go. Send our people back. Kuloi and to Duwina. Choose this path. Mm. This is of the wrong type, but we don't care. It was a great battle and a greatly long episode. Thank you for watching. A great time until next time and happy gaming. What will be our future plans? Maybe. I mean... They're still Vladimir, right? Oh my god, they've got, they've got good allies. Hmm... We'll see about that in the future, and maybe Petchora. A great time until next time, and happy gaming. This is Imamur Khan, signing out.